Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Gramps. We are on day 1971 of our trek, and it is time to explore another nugget of wisdom, which includes an inspirational quote along with some wise words from Gramps for today's trek. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. So we are on our daily trek to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. This is Gramps. Thanks for coming along on today's trek as we increase wisdom and create a living legacy. We are told in Proverbs chapter 16, verse 16, How much better to get wisdom than gold and sound judgment than silver? If you apply the words that you hear today, over time, it will help you to become more healthy, wealthy, and wise as you continue on your daily trek of life. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. And today's quote is from Erica Jong, and it is, Always do the things you fear the most. Courage is an acquired taste like caviar. So today's nugget is, Acquiring Courage. I don't believe that I've ever tasted caviar, so I am not sure that it is an acquired taste, but the thought of eating raw fished eggs is not very appealing to me. In addition to that, I understand that caviar is quite expensive, so that would stop me from buying it anyway, even if I did enjoy it. I can vouch that courage is an undoubtedly something that we do acquire when we are exposed to the things that we fear most. Of course, there is a limitation to our ability to handle fear, but if you gradually do the things that are not comfortable for you and you persevere through them, you will slowly gain courage. With each occurrence of overcoming fear, you will see your courage grow and even multiply exponentially. So do what you desire, even if it is a bit fearful. The more frightening the test may be, the more you should attempt it, which will also build your courage. Always do the thing that you fear the most, and then watch your courage build. Facing fears will open new doors that you never thought imaginable. And today's passage is 1 John chapter 4, verses 16-19. through 19. We know how much God loves us, and we have put our trust in His love. God is love, and all who live in love live in God, and God lives in them. As we live in God, our love grows more perfect, so we will not be afraid of the day of judgment, but we can face Him with confidence because we will live like Jesus here in this world. Such love has no fear, because perfect love expels fear. If we are afraid, it is for fear of punishment, and this shows that we have not fully experienced His perfect love. We love each other because He first loved us. And as you ponder this nugget of wisdom for yourself, please encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you want to listen to any of our past 1,970 treks or read the wisdom journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. In addition, I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day will be downloaded to you automatically. If you'd like to receive our weekly newsletter called Wisdom Notes, please email me at guthrie at wisdom-trek.com. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life, together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, Learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave the living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you next time for more Daily Wisdom.